on my way to go get some coffee before Carl gets here. Carol uh, had to get up really early <laughs> to walk Sam. Sam needed his walkies. So uh, now she's just sleeping in us a little bit longer. And uh, yeah, when Carl comes, Carol and Sam will leave. They can take their time. And uh, so right now I'm just gonna go get uh, coffee at that uh, Muskoka coffee place we got last year. They have the best voted chocolate chip cookies. Oh look, a camper van. That camper van is for sale. It's got an upper deck on it. It's been around. Holy schmoly. It's even got an awning. Huh. Last night the uh, fish and chips were amazing. Uh, I prefer halibut. I love halibut now ever since I've kind of tried a bunch of different fish over the years. Halibut is my 100% favorite fish to have as fish and chips. This is a nice solid fish. It's almost like chicken. Uh, so last night we uh, had our dinner and then we watched, um, what's it called? Hitman's Bodyguard, Ryan Reynolds, Samuel L. Jackson. And uh, we watched that and part two, which is, I think it's uh, Hitman's, Hitman's Wife's Bodyguard or something like that. So both of them are amazing. If you have the time, watch them back to back and uh, you'll enjoy it as much as we did. And they went to bed. I can't remember what time we went to bed last night, but I think it was 11.30. So got them all rested up, ready for a day of editing with Carl. And uh, then I'm gonna be meeting up with a supporter of the channel, subscriber fan of the channel his name is Dylan he's going through some rough times uh, and then after that I'm going to be hanging out with Mark and Kevin from Muskoka Bearware and the K-Dog and Fish pop culture figurines so there's the place best voted cookie I'm in I'm not going to have that for breakfast Camp Muskoka. Thank you. I would love one of your large, amazing coffees, please. And uh, if I could unfog myself. Oh. Uh, no, it's black. Um, that's it. Glass is off. No, I'll get a couple of croissants, please. That would be. I know, it's the time of year where your glasses fall off anyways, and then you put a mask on there and it's yeah. over, right? And these are new and they're really tight to my face, so they fog right up. Yeah. James, thank you. Thank you. All right. This place is cool, man. It's got all the decor. That's where they roast their beans. Thank you very much. Have a, Have a good day. You too. Ciao. Okay, thanks. All right, got my coffee. Good to go. They uh, must have run out of their special cups. So I remember they had like uh, 
purple cups with their name on it and everything. They're branding all over it. Ooh. But they have good sales on right now. There is K-Dog and Fish Pop Culture Collectibles and Muskoka Bearware. A lot of cool little stores. I might want to... I don't think they're open, but there's a pub here. A gastro pub. And, uh, but they... They're closed Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I don't know how you stay in business being close four days a week. So I have no idea how long Carl is going to be here today. It all just depends on how quickly we edit and how smoothly things go. Uh, we haven't been having a whole lot of problems with footage, which we've had in the past because of like camera, camera um, operators that you hire. Sometimes they just don't do a great job. So you're, you have like six shots of six different fish, but one of them, the sound's awful or he's not actually shooting uh, at the right moment. So anyway, so a lot of problems in the past so far this year, not a whole lot of camera issues, which is amazing. And uh, makes editing go by a little bit smoother for sure. All right, let's get back, wait for Carl. Make sure the, the computer's all set up, ready to go. And uh, Actually, when I first turned the computer on today and, and double-clicked on his projects, it came up saying, oh, did you want to upgrade the software? And he said, I guess the computer did an opera, um, like an automatic software update. And then when I opened up the Final Cut Pro documents, they, uh, they wanted to be updated too. And the first time I clicked it, it crashed the software and uh, that was kind of worrisome thinking that the program was going to launch but it did had to restart that process do a force quit restart go they've done a lot of work to this place looks like they painted they took down all the trees or shrubs or whatever between the building and the parking lot and they're build, building this retaining wall. Uh, and they also put some lights along that side. And I'm pretty sure that this, the owners prior to these owners, they actually slowly started buying up all these houses and turning them into cottages uh, for their extended hotel usage. See if there's anybody in the haunted room. Mm. See the curtains move a little bit? Yeah, it's scary stuff right there. All right, let's get to work. Enjoy my coffee, and we'll talk to you guys later. Oh, yeah, the stairs of doom. Not these ones. That's not doomish. That's, a, that's our hotel room up there. Great view though, let me tell you, it's worth every step.